Okay, let's go again. Two one three zero. Yeah, not F six. <laughs> six frames of defense. Uh, I'll try and play normally. Uh, okay. Uh, all right, I'll go for F five here. Oh, nice. It's giving me this this nice looking position. Um, can I be worse here? Hmm. Maybe just b6, bishop b7, later d4, knight can come back maybe to d5, you know, knight b4 to d5. Solves, solves the light square bishop problem anyway. Uh, uh, d4, is that worth playing to give me a bit of extra space? I think so, I think so, because white's then going to d4, why not? Okay. Now, can I play a5? Because my a3 thingy, so I just put that put that plan out of action immediately with a5? I'm tempted, I'm tempted. Let's play a3 anyway. A4. So how is he going to gang up on that pawn? A4. Do I want this bishop here or on c7? I mean, queen b8, bishop d8 to c7. Knight uh, e4 is going to be useful. Well, let's try this anyway, queen b8. Let's try an i e5 even more. So I'm delaying casting, I just want to get this bishop d8 to c7 in. Bit of a delay on his part, he's thinking about this. Clamp down his queen side a little bit. I know it's sort of cosy on f5 still. I wonder if um, he's going to play bishop h3 at some point. Okay, so that looks as though it's solid. Was it uh, knight takes knight takes c5? So yep, he has overprotected that square quite well. What can I do here? Maybe knight a5 to b3. Try that knight a5 to b3. Although, what is the knight doing on b3? Hmm. Can I play. If I could, actually, if it's protecting c5, I can play b5 later. Rook a5, b5 is trying to generate some pressure on the queen side. Oh, is that too slow? In fact, knight takes f7, takes knight g5, but I don't know if, if, that's, if that's that harmful, so I'll go ahead with this. In fact, rook f8 is knight h7. So I'll just, I'll just leave that. b5. Takes bishop d5 maybe. Okay, I'll try that. Because then that will be protecting e6. I can then play queen takes b5. And this is really going to sack knight g5 and bishop d5 takes an e6. I don't know if that's really dangerous or not. Okay, I'll take care. Maybe c4 next. I'll peel open the queen side. Okay, if I take care, bishop, maybe that's better. Um, now, can I just castle queen side? Castle queen side. Just to play uh, rook d7 or something. Ah, oh, okay. I'll get rid of this dangerous bishop. Maybe knight takes d6 next. Because now it's protecting f7, I might have queen b7 on the diagonal. Queen f3, queen b7, maybe. So it's, this knight's useful actually, it's stopping rook c1, unless he wants to sack the exchange. So queen b7 now. Is he really going to play knight c6? I guess knight c6. Hmm, nope. 
I thought my 86 was dangerous. So can I get away with f6 and e5? f6, knight g6. Uh, the rook e8. I'll just shut this window. Okay, let's see. So king takes b7. f6, knight g6, rook e8. Is that okay for me? I hope so. If I can get an e5, that'll look really good. Uh, positioning this, this is starting to look as so though it could be really tasty. If I play the cards right. So e5 now, I drop h5. Oh dear, I'm dropping a pawn. Uh, I should play anyway. I'll play anyway. Strong sort of pawns over there. Okay, I'll protect that one. But then maybe c4. Takes maybe knight c5, and I've got these two pawns. Ah, oh, that's a surprising move. And I'll go for this anyway, trying to liberate these pawns. Get the knight c5, that looks strong. Except I've given a nice knight on d5. Okay, <laughs> these changed there. <laughs> oh, it's all under control. Big, big, big pass d pawn. What, what more can I ask for? <laughs> he hasn't got too much time to create a pass pawn over here. So if I can just get this d pawn going, uh, or will I? Oh, he's going to sack the exchange back to rookie one. Okay, can I play d three? Um, we'll get the king in. We'll get the king in. Again, e4 and d3. d3 here. Yeah. We can get rook. Rook first, then e4 check. Or king d5, then e4. Rook f4 is also. Potentially useful. Right, okay, if I play e4, I'll try this first because maybe there's knight e6 to g5. Knight e6 check. Oh, maybe not. I'll go back there. Oh, these pawns are becoming dangerous. Uh, this can get, get rook d5 in. Oh. Knight e6, oh, h7. But then check. Where does the king go? Um, let me. Oh, king h6. Okay, I might, I might have to take. Oh. Actually, actually, maybe knight f8 here. Oh. Right, knight f4 here. I can't get my pawns going either, can I? I'm going to rook. <laughs> that might help. Um, or it might not. Hmm. Um. Oh, let's try and just keep solid with 97 check. E3 maybe. Oh, okay, hold on. Let's see where is this king going? Okay. Is he repeating that? Free here. It's going to be six. Not nice see six then. All right. If I can get in knight e5 or e3. Oh god, I've just lost the e3 pawn. Which didn't take. Uh, okay, e2. Um, 
Yeah, he's coming in for another. Can I just almost win the queen? Let's go and check. Alright, I'll just take this and play D2. <laughs> That is ridiculous. Oh, I apologise for this game. I apologise. <laughs> I don't know what happened. Uh, I thought it was all going well at some point, actually. There was a point where... I thought it was plain sailing. Uh, where was this point? So, I think it was around here. I thought I was in a good position. Please leave any comments or questions on YouTube. Thanks very much.